basically I worked in the architectural lighting field, but doing lighting and controls. So controls for energy efficient buildings. So you see all these towers downtown with the lights on 24 seven, we might have systems in them that will dim down the lights when sunlight comes in the windows. That's for like day, daylight harvesting or what I did mostly was branding and marketing through illumination. So uh, everyone knows the CN Tower downtown. It's got all those digitally What's controlled, that? excuse me, the CN Tower downtown. Wait, what's the CN? Oh, I'm just kidding. Just, <laughs> just kidding. Yeah. yeah. For those of you that don't know, this big tower needle downtown that has the lights on it. At one point was the largest freestanding building in the world. And yeah. now the one in Dubai beat it. But anyway. That's so those systems that are on that, I basically sold those, programmed them and worked with electricians in the field to commission them, get them started and 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 going. And I was the you know forward facing client relations person for a lot of these multi-million dollar projects. I've got a lot of the color changing buildings that you see downtown, um, I had a hand in at one point or another. Actually, the, the company I was with uh, did have a big part in the CN Tower. That was a long time ago now. But uh, yeah, so that that was a very fun career, illustrious career. I did that for almost a decade. Um, but also along the time, we wanted to start a family and uh, get out of the hustle and bustle of the city. And um, so about a, about a year after we had our first child, um, I was doing a commute down to the Niagara region. We live in uh, Grimsby now, and um, which you helped us out yeah. find that amazing house, by the way. Yeah. And um, yeah, I was like in traffic one day. It was a two hour plus drive back home, which was common. And uh, I started getting like lightheaded and, and foggy and I was stressed and anxiety. I was on a project to like two in the morning the night before and work was demanding and I was like, you know what, man, this is, I, sh I shouldn't feel like this. This is not right. If you enjoyed this clip and want to hear more, subscribe to the DC Talks podcast on YouTube or wherever you listen to your podcast.